Mm-hmm. Uh, Budneck, yes. Is his first name Pierce? Yeah. Pierce Franklin or Franklin Pierce? Mm. Mm-mm. You know, I thought his last name was Pierce. His father's last name was Pierce, wasn't it? Yes. He was a son of General Benjamin Pierce. His first name's not Pierce Franklin. No. Nah. His name was Franklin Pierce. Oh. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Well, let's see here. Budnick, yes, made a very quiet campaign, as was the custom now. <laughs> Having a very quiet campaign today. <laughs> Just wanting to make sure that I understand how electricity is manufactured. <laughs> you know, um, it looks like his vice president, Pence, are you there in the White House? Vice President King was in poor health when when the time of the inauguration arrived. <laughs> he had gone to Cuba for his health. Yes. I wanted to go to Cuba for my health. <laughs> I thought I'd buy a large number of 1940s and 50s hotels. Yes. <laughs> because Cuba used to be very, very available to the United States of America's citizens to travel to. Yes. Then there was that Fidel Castro problem, and he recently retired or deceased, and he deceased. I'm sorry to hear that. <laughs> but let's say that I wanted to make a large investment in Cuba because I like the kind of hotel where you can spy on the other guests. Yes. Put listening devices in the telephone so I can hear what people are saying in other rooms. <laughs> Put video cameras in every room so I can watch people have sex with each other. <laughs> It's the spy hotels of Cuba that I was wanting to invest in, for those that have to know. <laughs> Seems that a lot of us have a small addiction to voyeurism because of being on each other. 